What's up, Asher? He's locked in the only channel bringing you gaming entertainment. I'm Chris, the Asher's Gamer, and this is Pokemon Sapphire. Last time we ended up defeating Glacia and Drake, the Dragon Master. And this time we're gonna go holla at Steven right quick. Actually, let me check all the movesets right quick, just to make sure I don't need to use any ethers. Flamethrower should be fine. I need to... Huh. Well, I don't need Iron Tail as much. Okay, so I know what I need to do. Uh... We're gonna use a max ether on Muddy Water for his Earthquake. And then we're gonna use that on Mystic Psychic. Alright, so let's go ahead and jump in. See what Steven has to offer. I am le leading with Eulis, and then the next two are Muddy Water and. Sterling because they have Earthquake. <clears throat> Whoa, what's with this music? Welcome Rashad, I was looking forward to seeing you here one day. You, what did you see on your journey with Pokemon? What did you feel, meeting so many other trainers like you? What has awoken in you? I want you to hit me with it all. Now, bring it. Ooh. It went from dissonance to like that to like melodious. melodious. <clears throat> and we are fighting the champion of the Hoenn region. Champion Steven would like to battle. <clears throat> oh, we have a Skarmory on the field. It's a male Skarmory, so no, it's not Kieran. Uh, let's see. Kidding. Okay. <clears throat> I want a flamethrower just to see what happens. <clears throat> huh. It okos. The earthquake wouldn't have worked on Skarmory anyway. Metagross. Actually, let's swap out. Because I know it has earthquake. And I don't feel like dealing with earthquake. Earthquake with Eulis out on a field like that. Instead, we're going to use Earthquake with Muddy Water, because it's Stab. I think that's his ace. Possibly. Let's Earthquake it. <clears throat> it only does half health. And he uses Psychic. Oh, uh, you little. I have to waterfall it. And I want an earthquake again. Here at Astros Gamer, we take risks. Not really, but I figured it'd be. Yeah. We're going to stay in on this Agron. It should be. Earthquake should actually be quite effective because it's rock. Fi uh, rock. Ti whoa. Rock. Steel. Alright, before we do anything else, I need to hyper potion it up. Hyper! And it uses Earthquake first move. <laughs> that was weak. That was weak, buddy. Now watch my Earthquake. You about to get blown away, watch. 
<laughs> he got blown. It was a crit. He got blown away like crazy. Oh shoot. Cradily. I think it's part grass. Let's switch back to Eulis. Because I think it's part grass. It's grass rock, probably. Oh crap, it's grass rock. No! I think. We'll see here in a minute. Let's overheat it. Social attack, harshly fail, ancient pep. Yep, it's part rock. Uh... Alright, let's not do that. Uh... Yeah, I should have stayed in and surfed it. Ancient power. Ancient power. It's not very effective. Surf is super effective. Well, it's grass rock, of course, but... Get, uh... Oh no, that's quad effective. No! I didn't think it could have a uh, Giga Drain. Earthquake, I guess. Confused rate. Seriously. Steven's probably going to heal this turn. So you know what I'm fixing to do? You guessed it, I'm about to heal as well. Oops. Let's see what our Iron Tail does. Ooh. Ooh. And it confuses me again. Oh, I knew that was going to happen. And it uses Giga Drain. I was going to say, it should be neutral. Grass isn't that. Grass isn't. That effective against steel. And we pull through with the iron tail. As my nasal passages start to get a little bit clogged up, so I might start sounding horribly here. If I hadn't already, let's see, clay doll. Ground psychic. That's levitate. Let's switch out to Kidding, because I feel she's the best candidate for that. Because ground attacks aren't good against it, and then... It's not really much to say about the Psychic type of it, but she can totally... Let's fly. Uh, ancient power. Flight. Huh. I might take this time to either revive on Muddy Water because I feel Muddy Water would probably be best cut for Claydol. Oh, it's setting up. Hmm. 
<clears throat> this is probably going to be long and drawn out, probably. Doing, of course. I think ancient power has five PP, so if we waste away the ancient powers, then we should be good. And that should be four ancient powers. Played off Lynch. <clears throat> Animus is going to use Light Screen. Ancient Power. You know what? I'm going to use Muddy Water. Screw it. Earthquake. Of course, you're going to use Earthquake. It's not going to be that effective, it's probably going to be neutral. Is that all of his Pokemon? Armado. Don't know what type it is. I'm going to Earthquake. Slash. Surf. Oh, okay. I think that does it for Steven. <clears throat> and we level up right at it, right after it too. We are the champions of the Hoenn region, ladies and champions. Uh, ladies and champions. Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I, the champion, fall in defeat. Kudos to you, Rashad. You're a truly noble Pokemon trainer. We got 11, we got 11k. Congratulations, the feelings you have for your Pokemon, and the Pokemon that respond to those feelings with all their might. They came together as one and created even greater power, and thus you are able to grasp victory today. You are rightfully the Hoenn region's new... Okay, so this is out of nowhere. May out of nowhere, like coming in as soon as uh, Steven grants me the title champion. Rashad! Oh, she thinks I haven't even faced the champion yet. Have you even faced the champion yet? You've been trying to catch Pokemon the whole time and you're going to give me advice on the champion. Well, it's too late, buddy. Huh? What? 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 Birch? What did I tell you, May? Did I tell you that don't that you don't need to worry about Rashad? Huh? Uh, <laughs> we see one hundred and thirty-one Pokemon and caught eighteen. <laughs> May tripping. This room. This is where we keep record of the Pokemon that prevailed through harsh battles. It's here that League Champions are honored. Come on, let's record your name as a trainer who triumphed over the Pokemon League. And the names of the partners who battle with you
saving, don't turn off the power. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Welcome to the Hall of Fame. League Champion. Congratulations. It only took me 48 hours. Well, guys. <clears throat> well, thank you guys for uh, hanging out, you know, chilling and whatnot, especially whenever the quality wasn't as great earlier. But once again, like, it's just like, it's like, it's just like Metro, uh, Metroid Prime 2, like, you just going with the flow with the videos and whatever, doing whatever you can with whatever you have, and then, next thing you know, huh? Anyway, next thing you know, you can't really do it anymore because it starts to start crapping out on you and you have to put a lot of money on a PC. And this is a gaming PC. But I built it with specs that would pretty much I built it with specs that would uh handle high quality high frame rate sort of content so that way I'll be in the league I'll be in league with a lot of the other uh YouTube content creators although I shouldn't really be worried too worried about what they do but you know, higher quality content is pleasing to the eye, so I'm not really going to elaborate too much on that. But as far as like my next content, I'm already done with Metroid Prime 2. I'm already done with, um, I'm already done with this now, as you can see. <clears throat> um, I'm thinking about bringing new kind, newer kinds of content. Like, not new new as far as like recently new, but like, stuff that I don't usually uh, do on the channel I have although I have been uh, ever since I've been watching or I saw a video by some colleague Johnny I think I might think about doing like Sonic Advance or something like that but also I might try to get my hands on Mega Man 2 and try to do that because this sort of like I guess newer as far as like content that I have not even uh introduced to the channel yet so I might do that I might I might have to do something like easy as far as like you know something easy to kind of fill up like so that way the channel is not just not upload uh not broadcasting videos so if you see me like do some stuff like Mario Kart 8, that's me trying to at least feel like pretty much feel the schedule up so that way I'll have a bit of time to think about what I want to do next. I know for sure I want to try Mega Man 2 and I want to try Sonic Adventure, or not Sonic Adventure, Sonic Advance 2. But in the future, before I do Metroid Prime 3, I might think about, or maybe even after Metroid Prime 3. I might think about uh, retrying Metro Prime, Metroid Prime 2 doing the vet, uh, Veterans mode because <clears throat> now that I have the new equipment, I'm kind of not satisfied with the result of all of Metroid Prime and the first half of Metroid Prime 2, or first more than half of Metroid Prime 2. But that's neither here nor there. Um, also, uh, pretty soon, if it's not out yet, uh, po uh, Pokemon Academy Life will be, uh, submitting their mo more recent demo. Like, they've been working on it, and they decided to, sometime in early 2007, to, uh, post a new demo. 
which will actually be pretty good because uh, <clears throat> I also have been doing a couple of uh, Pokemon Academy Life videos here and there a lot recently, so that way, because the quality of the stuff I did in the past was not as great, but the whole point of it is I'm trying to do away with the O where it was not that great and try to, I guess, keep up with the times, but oh, hey, the TN screen, uh, disappeared. And we're already 21 minutes into the video, but as far as the next content, You'll have to bear with me because I'm not sure with what I want to do yet. And. Yeah. But anyway, until until that point, always know. No matter what you do, no, many, no matter how many of the crappy videos I've done in the past you watch. Just remember that the Asterisk Gamer is always here for you.